Hey guys, welcome back to more Nalvis. Hope you're all doing very, very well. The last time we left off, we went over to Sarthal and we found ourselves a gigantic orb and had a bit of a boss fight for which we were very much over leveled for. But you know, even that gave us a little bit of trouble. But once we figured it out, we were a okay. Uh, yeah, what are we doing now then? So we need to go speak to Urag Grow Shrub, the, uh, the orc. And we need to study the orb, I think. That's pretty much it. Uh, look into information on the object. Yep, we need to go have a look at the orb. And pretty much everything else here that we do eventually want to finish at some point. Let's hope. But yeah, while we make our way over to uh, good old... What's his name again? Urag. Once we... Uh, yeah, while we make our way over to him, if you haven't already, uh, be sure to hit the like and sub button. It would help a lot to me if you could do that. We also have a Patreon in the description below as well. Thank you very much. Are we in the right building for this, uh, by the way? Let me check the map here real quick. No, we, we have to leave. Fine. I don't know which building we're in. Is it the one with the Arcan... The, Ar the Arcanium in this? Uh, or are we in one of the dorm rooms? Steps. I have. I got to about 414 when I got attacked by a frost troll. But I think I was more than halfway up. I'm fairly sure we'll have to do that quest line at some point, counting the old steps, but, you know, thank Christ it's not manually. Because I don't believe that there are 7,000 steps. I think it's just either slightly north and south of, or south of that number. I think, like, a weird Khajiit gives you that uh, quest line, like, just outside uh, the steps themselves. I think he, like, hangs out there. So we'll get that quest line, we'll do it, and we'll uh, inevitably annoy him. Let's see. Yeah, he's gonna be in the Arcanium. Alright, let's pop in. Heard they were forming a Dawn Guard. Yeah, no, the Dawn Guard contacted me. I hope to God if we ever do get va uh, you know, vampirism again and I'm out of uh uh goddamn cure disease potions will have either a vigilant of Stendar or a member of the Dawn Guard if they do in fact heal. Uh just, you know, all around me. I mean that'll be ideal. We need to be very careful, though, when finding people who, you know, need help randomly out in the, uh, out in the snow. I think, I think I've learned my lesson when it comes to that. Is Adara still here? Is that you? Learning from Colette, eh? Oh, God love you. Not a, not a huge fan of her. Hello there. I don't want to see you treating any of these books poorly. Are we clear? Yeah, no, fine, but uh, we need to learn about something we found in Zarthal. I know what you want. Word travels fast around here. Discovered some big mystery, huh? Well, you don't even need to ask. I like no, I don't have anything for things. you. Not anymore, anyway. Oh? Why aren't you the book guy? You tell me the library is completely just incomplete? Completely incomplete. You tell me the library is just incomplete? I said not anymore. Orthorn stole a number of books when he ran off to Felglow Keep to join those summoners. Oh. Some kind of peace offering. I think one of those volumes may have had some relevant information. If you want them, you'll have to talk to Orthorn. Where the hell is Orthorn at? I mean, does anyone care that Orthorn is a bit of a thief? Anyway, who is he anyway? He was an apprentice here at the college. Not very skilled, but got involved with a group of mages who took a liking to him. When they left... He took off after them, stole supplies and books from the college. I suppose as a way to ingratiate himself. We're gonna have to kill him, aren't we? Uh, why are there mages at Felglow Keep anyway? Let's just call it a difference of opinion with the college. They were interested in research that goes outside the bounds of what the college allows, so they were persuaded to leave. Ah, uh, tried to go over into blood magic, did they? Hmm, actually, do you have... Spell tomes on sale. I things laying around that weren't worth adding to the collection. You may look through them. I may. Oh, good lad. Uh, let's see what we got here. Take a look at the books. Do we have tomes? We have no tomes. A blue book of riddles for what? Fourteen crowns. I'll buy that. Uh, legions of the date. Well, if we ever want to uh, switch over to a bit of necromancy, remember we have a special tree for that. It's something we could look into. I'll buy that. Uh, okay, what else we got here? ABCs for barbarians. Well, we're not one of those. Argonian account, brief history of the empire. So pretty much I imagine these are all books we can find out in the wild anyway, so that's fine. Scrolls are one use. No, thank you. I want the more permanent thing. Right, let's go. Oh, actually, no, we're not done with you yet. Um, 
Oh, have you made any uh, progress translating uh, Shalador's work? We were able to figure out the last text you brought in. I thought the least I could do is pass the knowledge along. Ah, very good. Illusion 3. Okay, is that a scroll? Must be a scroll. Uh, yes, so, um, doesn't the college care? Not enough to bother with. Archmage Aaron's approach to these things is just to let them sort themselves out. Although now it looks like you'll be doing the sorting. Good luck with that. I get the feeling that the Archmage is not very, uh, you know, he's, he, he doesn't have a lot of agency around him, does he? You know, very lazy, very lazy man. Uh, God knows I even made it up to that position. All right, let's go. Until next time. I want to take a look at that scroll, though, that we got. Um, we can find it here. Uh, illusion. All right, it should be in here somewhere, I think. Either that or I am completely, uh, completely blind. Okay, hang on. Gonna go into this. We'll just type in illusion. Up oh, there it is. Shallow Doors Insights. Illusion 3. So yeah, obviously it's a scroll, but can I not? Uh, oh, there we go. Increases the duration and decrease of the cost of illusion spells for 144 seconds. What's that, just uh, south of three minutes? Uh, that's kind of like, meh. We got three of them, though, so that's good. Like, kind of meh. But then again, he said he only did, like, one part of, um... Yeah, he only translated one part of uh, the book, so I don't, I don't know. We'll let a bit of time pass. We'll come back to him. Maybe he'll give me more. You there. I have questions for you. Oh, God. You were in Sarthal, yes? It has come to my attention that something was found there. Yeah, you're... No, no maybe. Okay, can we not lie? I want to lie. I don't want to be coy. I know full well that you have. Please do not insult my intelligence. Tolfdir is still there now, is he? I shall expect a full report when he returns. Why, so you can feed it to your Thalmor masters? I mean, why do you care? Something was discovered in Sarthal that was significant enough that Tolfdir sent a new member of the college alone to deliver word. That sounds precisely like the sort of thing that should matter to everyone, especially me. Thank you for your help. You may go now. I may go now. Cool. Thank you. Oh, God. We're going to enjoy killing you, whatever level you are. If it turns out you're level 50, we may have a bit of a problem with that. Right, let's get the hell out of here. I'm just going to move my mic. You may hear a thump. There we go. And rotate. Lovely. Right, so uh, find the stolen books. Right, where are the stolen books, pray tell? Uh, main map. Let's go have a look. Bleak Coast Cave, could, could we maybe reliably clear that out now? I think the trolls were like level 30, but the last time we were there, we were like level 5. So I don't know, maybe we can reliably clear that out. Could be like a little side thing that we could end up doing. Shrine of Azura, Abandoned Cave, Mount Anthor, the Gold Dragon. Uh, that's going to be the thing down there that we don't need. We are marking the quest line, yes? So either that, uh, either it's not in the general area or I'm blind. Hang on, let's double check, make sure we're marking this thing. And now we definitely are. Northeast of Whiterun. Oh god, northeast of Whiterun, that's quite far. So like, Whiterun's here, so, oh Jesus, okay, we got a, got a bit of a trek ahead of us. I'll tell you what we can do, we can kind of um, just skim past uh, Bleak Coast Cave on the way. And go double check, see if we can actually, you know, see if we can actually beat that. Uh, can I leave? There we go. Hey, I don't know, Colette, who's saying that restoration is not a valid school of magic. That thing's been single handedly keeping me alive, apart from the points where I die. Thank God for basic healing. Also, thank God that my health pool is so low. That means I can full heal in uh, no time at all. Well, you know, we should probably look into increasing my health pool, you know, one of these days. We'll get around to it. It's just, I, I need the mana pool to be huge. I need it to be absolutely gigantic. In fact, I need to find new gear that can even increase the mana pool further. Yes. Oh, you're, you're a traveling apothecary. Hang on. Take a look. I like your axes. I think you have two. Do you only have one? Either way, I like your axe. Tell me you have potions of cure poison. That's not disease, though. And, you know, that's halfway there. We'll buy that. What's that? Uh, 60, 41 crowns? Uh, septums, even? Yeah, all right. 
Uh, yeah. Actually, can we sell her anything that we don't need? Like, we made this really crappy poison potion with a value of 3. But at the very least, this should get me XP anyway, so we'll sell that. Uh, weak draft of magic, and we'll need that too. Featherfall. No, not Featherfall, just increasing my carrying capacity. Uh, we're doing kind of okay in regards to encumbrance, so I'll get rid of that anyway. Uh, I think that's another potion that we made. Actually, no, I probably found that one. That potion's too good to be one of mine. Alright, so I think if we go out, yeah, the main entrance here, not the back one, we should be on our way to the um, cave system in no time. Now, we do have a lot that we can do in regards to killing uh, the trolls out there. I mean, we're a lot better with our fire spells. We do a lot more damage. Beautiful day, by the way. Do a lot more damage. We have Conjuration now, although the Flesh Golem doesn't actually hit anything. It does, you know, it can prove itself to be a bit of a distraction, and that's ideally what we'll need so I can keep uh, pounding out the damage. Yeah, that's probably my dinner. That's not Flamethrower, though. I think that's the spell that could possibly kill me, so we'll go with Flames. Damn it, get back here. I need rapid legs. Alrighty then, so the cave is gonna be that away. Oh god, man, I feel my eye. I feel my retina is being burned out. The sun reflection on the snow with no cloud, a very little cloud cover, man, is enough to make a man blind when you're up here. Holy crap. But it does enhance the overall aesthetic and beauty, I think. Now down here is where we got vampirism. So, as I said before, any other weirdos kind of struggling in the snow? We're gonna, they're gonna find that I won't be as altruistic as I was last time, we're gonna leave them be. Although we do have one spare potion of uh, cure disease left. So you know, I, I can afford to be a little bit reckless just one more time, but... Uh, not all the time. Unless we get to Whiterun, because I know Whiterun does have an apothecary. And in fact, if we're going down to Whiterun, or just, uh, you know, north of Whiterun, we'll actually be very close to uh, Helgen. Now, where is uh, this thing? The, uh, the cave? Oh, it's over here. Oh god, we gotta get cold, alright. No, oh, come on, man! What, just because I didn't thieve all the time? Come on. Damn you, deity. Damn you. Oh, hello. Uh, no, I won't do any of that. Just want to take the, uh, take the loot. Actually, hang on. So if we field dress the carcass, what does that do for me? So we did something. Back to that. Did I take damage? It would appear that I'm covered in blood and I don't like it. No, no, we're fine. Okay, so what if we, uh... Oh, okay, that's interesting. So what if I butcher the meat? Does that mean I can get different types of uh, meat products from, from him? I'm not sure if that did anything. Oh no, that definitely did something. Time is, in fact, uh... Passing while we do this. I think I got raw canine meat. I'll tell you what, we'll uh, leave it there. Now, I'm not sure if we got more canine meat than we would usually get if I had, uh, you know, looted him, you know, in the vanilla fashion, but yeah, I think that's the issue. Like, you spent a couple of hours in game time doing that, and that's really easy to get uh, hungry, thirsty, or, you know, cold. Speaking of which. Eh, eat the goat. Love me a bit of goat. Right. Let's see if we're anywhere near ready for this. Even if we're only half the level, like, I think that might be enough. If we're a tenth of the level, then no, we gotta go. What's over there? Is that like a lighthouse? Hmm. Nope. Oh. Is that thing alive or did you kill it? If so, well done, man. Although you're probably low level anyway, so come here. Ah. Wolfie! Where are you going, buddy? 
There we go, beautiful. Yeah, it's probably just better to loot him like that. You alive? No, no, you are super dead. See, the problem with Horker meat, though, is it's very heavy. So, can I have five here, just in case? And, uh, I don't know, fuck it, we'll pop in. Uh, it's probably the troll that killed that. And look at this. It's a lot of human remains, my goddamn. Ooh, yeah. Well, let's see how bleak things are in here. Now, we're going to go into sneak mode, and we're just going to try and see what we can do. I'm just gonna peek, have a look at the level. If the level is a little bit too bullshit, then uh, we're just gonna back out quietly. If it's within the realm of, uh, you know, if it's within the realm of, you know, achievability, then we should be all right. We'll see. What level are we looking at here? Don't know. What level are we looking at here? Still don't know, right? Here's what we're gonna do. We're just gonna, um. Yeah, we're just gonna bring ourselves out of Flesh Colossus that I know isn't gonna do anything for me in terms of offense, but it might prove to be a meat shield. It's made out of flesh after all. Now, go in there, try and kill the troll. Or not. Good to see you again, by the way. You look like an amnesia monster. Where'd it go? Hello? All right, here's what I'm gonna do. We're just gonna firebolt it a fuckload of times and hope that we get lucky. 22, we can kill that. Oh, he on fire. Oh, he is... Oh, that counted? Shit, okay, that counted. Where'd my guy go? Good guy! Help me! Oh, yeah. Yeah, we good. Oh, we can do it. <laughs> we can do it easily as well. They're only level 22. I thought they were in their 30s, man. That's sick. What are we, like, level 18? Yeah, level 18 on the verge of 19. Perfection. Let's see what we have in here, though. I, I want to just double check because we do have Lich Tim here. And I think, yeah, that's Necromancy at the end of the day. But Lich Tim is becoming a skeleton yourself. So I just want to, like, check this out real quick. Oh my god, I can flat out just go into lich form? How does one, how does one go into lich form? So what are we looking here at the end then? Black Mass Hysteria. Okay. Gain Viper Strike, spell in both, both lich and mortal form. Oh my god. I gotta find out how to do that. That that could that that could be epic. I will keep this uh, spell out just in case. See what we're dealing with here. Surely there's gonna be more of them. Or this could be that, you know, all the cave has to offer, but I don't know. Looks small enough. We'll see what's in the back. Oh, hello. Put him down. Burn, you son of a bitch. Yeah, he doesn't know what's going on. He saw the explosion effect as well. Really good if you can just spam that out. Oh, hello. That is a really high value. I'm gonna take that. Take that as well, take the book. Uh, the cowl and the dress and whatnot, it's just, yeah, crap. Leave it be. God, did he venture in here on his own? Probably low level. Now where are the rest of the trolls? Can't leave here with the job half done. So that's the way out. Went that way into the side cavern. I think, I, I, yeah, it must be it. I think we got them all. Cool, well done me. Ooh. Ring of Desiccation. 4K. Hmm. Have a quick look at that. Rings are in armor, are they not, or apparel? Walk on the surface of water. Can swim underwater without drowning. So wait. If I walk on the surface of water, am I able to break? The surface of the water to actually swim? I don't know, but we're gonna put that on. Now, can I wear more than one ring? No, I can't. I have, you know, ten digits, but only one ring. Okay, that's absolutely fine. That was Death Ward. Oh, yeah, we know what that is. So, apparently I'm a water walker now, so that's cool. We'll take the drugs. Alright. Oh, hello. What have we here? 
Got 3 XP for that. Not bad. Okay, you missed out on 31 logs, so... I think this diary is at a few pages uh, torn out. The way he's talking, this guy was uh, Khajiit. Also, the skooma was, you know, a really good clue too. They won't- yeah, yeah, no, they, they noticed, man, they got you. Unlucky, buddy. Unlucky. They ate the crap out of you, didn't they? Well, thankfully the trolls are all gone. We're good. Gave us safe. Ideally, yeah, permanently. But we'll see. Could come back here in a week in game time from now and uh, I'll just be repopulated again. Who knows? Nope. Oh, we're not done yet. Body in here too. Hmm. Okay, there's more to this uh, part as well. I think we went up here, but obviously we didn't go in there. So I want one troll. We're okay. Burn the bitch. The fall of Winterhold. Once owned by a mage who plummeted into, into the sea during the Great Collapse. Oh, shit. And another Khajiit. Oh, man. It's always sad seeing my kind die. Especially to these fucking things. Anyway, yeah, let's take a look at that cloak. That's an interesting find. I wonder if, like, anyone in the college will actually, um, will actually recognize that. Does give me less warmth, but the cloak we're wearing now doesn't do anything, so now we're gonna put that on. There we go. What do we look like? Ooh! Ooh, I like that. I wonder what it gives me, though. Because it didn't actually say in the description. Just remnants of his power remain. But what kind of mage was he? Interesting. Puddle of blood. What? That's kind of random. Okay, it would appear that I have some effect going on right now, so is there anything in here? From that cloak? Fall of Winterhold. Oh, increases maximum magicka by 60 points. Hell yeah, okay, that's cool. So we take a look at my guy, 350 now, sick! Okay, that was a savage find, I'm delighted with that. Oh. Oh, it's my Colossus. Oh, okay. Wait. So by... No way. So by, uh... Yeah, so by summoning these things, I can farm these items? Huh. Good way to get soul gems, I guess. And, you know, human flesh. And, you know, it's okay for me to eat human flesh. I'm not a human. That's interesting, though. Let's get out of here. We're good. That could not have gone better. That could not have gone better. Delighted. All right, very good. So, now we can actually uh, get the hell out of this uh, little area, get back up to the road, make our way down to the Azura's Pass trading post. Um, they are a trading post, so they should have an inn. Or if they don't, at the very least, it'll be a place for me to get warm. Like I did over there. That one time I almost died of exposure. That fire saved my ass. Look at this cloak, though. Like, if we don't find a better cloak, you know, for a while, we could definitely end up wearing this thing for the majority of the playthrough. And with the, what, the bipolar plate on my back? Like, we look good. We look cool. God damn it. Oh shit. Goodbye. So, that'd be a bit of a trek. Um, maybe in a blizzard right now. Okay, we do have a fire up here, but uh, that area might not be empty. In fact, there's something up there. Okay, there's something big up there. Let's uh, come around the side here. So I think I've killed this thing already. It could just be another Minotaur. How's it going, big boy? I killed you already. What are you doing back here? Unless I was in a different area, in which case you're new. Alright, well, you could have a bullshit level. 
And I don't really want to aggravate you all that much, which is why we're gonna cheat. Now I'll aggravate you. Enjoy, buddy. Yeah, level 40, but we can kill it. We just need to stay away from it. Thankfully, he is slowish. Oh. Oh, don't we love the explosions, though? Beautiful. Come on, buddy. Down you go as your AI breaks. Oh, shit. What? Did that phase right through? Are you joking? And good night. Ooh, glass great swords. Yeah, really good place to go if you just want to find a shitload of weaponry, but I kind of just want the horns. I messed with the bull and I want my prize. Warm up here for a bit. That was looking at me. Oh. Oh. Hello? On a hunt, are we? I'll tell you what, keep going. Who knows? Maybe you'll actually get us. Or you'll give up. <laughs> Fair enough. Wonder if they're friendly. Let's go over to them. Let's go over to them and introduce ourselves. No? Oh, they're bandits. Ah, oh, well, there you go. Well, in that case, uh, unbound fire? Because I don't think I've actually used this yet. Oh, that's cool. I like that. It's kind of like a little dragon uh, thing. Hi. Oh, got him on fire. <laughs> not gonna lie, unbound fire might actually be, uh, yeah, might not be the best way to do things. More likely to kill myself. That's good to know. Level 21, though. Okay. This is why we have firebolt. This is why we have firebolt. Oh, I'm being shot at. How lovely. Thankfully, though, with the velocity of the arrows, we can see coming a mile away and still dodge it. Oh, you're quite quick, though. That I highly dislike. Oh, you're here. Yeah, done. That's it. Down you go. Take the fire. And you know what? Just general flamethrower, then. Oh, watch out. That's it. Burn, you son of a bitch. I know you're on fire. Stay on fire. Oh, you got shot by your friend. Ah. Aha. And good night. That's it. That's it. <laughs> All right, where, where's, uh, where's the other one? You shot your friend. You helped me out. Thanks for that. Could use the cover, though. Oh. That must have been the explosion. Right, well, you know what we have? We have a sword. I'm going to finish you off with it. Oh, 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 beautiful. Uh, the good old bipolar blade. Gotta love it. All gone? See, there can't be any bandits in my part of town. I won't allow us. I think we got them all. Ooh, money. Uh, not much of anything else that we need. Overall, I call that very successful. Oh, we're not done yet. Are you the one who uh, lagged behind? Where are you at? Buddy! You another archer? You hiding? Come on, don't don't be such a wuss. Get over here. Get over here so I can put you down with the rest. Oh, you're stuck. Would you look at that? You know what, buddy, man? I'm, uh... Oh, I feel for you there, man. I really do. I've been, I, I've been glitched into walls in many a game, including this one. God, Stoneflesh is expensive. God damn. I'm just, gonna, I'm just gonna give you a little singe. Look like you're cold. Just die already, bastard. No. Go to your god. Although he didn't exactly die, you know, with uh, honor. So does he go to like, uh, like he shouldn't go to, you know, in-game Valhalla or anything. What's that? Uh, what's uh, Purgatory? In the, uh, in the Norse mythos? He should go there. Helheim, I think, or something like that, I don't know. Now, what the hell do we have up here? I don't think I've been up here yet. It's looking like a gate that kind of denotes, uh, the border into the next, uh, Yarldom. Yeah, I'm here. Oh, oh, oh. Those are Vigilance of Stendar, look at that. 
I like to think they'll have absolutely no trouble. I wonder who, um... Oh, shit, did one die? No. Oh, oh, shit. Oh, well, this is a whole thing. We're just gonna back off. And while we run away, we're gonna put a cut in here. So, hopefully you guys have been enjoying the playthrough so far. Absolutely adore playing this game when we come back. Who knows, maybe we'll decide to help out our, uh... Our allies who are getting absolutely slaughtered. We'll see. Anyway, guys, have a good one. See you soon. Bye-bye. Thank <laughs> you.